What's up guys, this is Brandon or Undead, and today I want to show you guys, or I mean not show, but explain to you guys the defensive things in NBA 2K13. So let's get started. Double team is just what it is. You double team, two defenders come up and just defend against the uh, attacker. Auto just, you know, it means that the game will decide. Never means that they'll never double team. And the post means if you press Y, you're in the post, and that's when it'll double team when you're in the post. On drive is when you start spraying to the basket by holding RT. Always means that they'll always double team whenever you're in the paint or inside the perimeter. Now, on ball defense means that it's around the perimeter of the defense, which is the ring. It's on the outside. Auto means that the game will decide. Sag off means that they'll step off the defender. They won't be close to him. Moderate means that they'll just put pressure on them. So it's kind of like play tight and sag off combined. Play tight means that they'll just be in your face and will not get out of your face. I mean, they'll just be in your face the whole entire time. Off ball is inside the perimeter and around the paint. Sag off, just, you know, sag off, you just step off. Moderate is just you just put pressure on them. Play tight means um, you play tight and you're really close to them. And this is really good against uh, using to steal from them. Still passes from and all that. And deny ball means that you'll deny any ball that comes into your lane. And it pretty much means um, you will steal every ball that you can possibly get. Say, for instance, they throw a pass half court. You will, one of your defenders will just put his arms up in the air and try to block the pass and all that. That's, they'll just deny any ball that comes towards them. Now, for screen, this is a big topic. Screen means that it controls on-ball defender and how they will react to the screen. So auto just means that the game will decide. Go over. This means that the on-ball defender will always try to go over the screener. And this is good against outside shooters, like three-pointers. Go under means that the on-ball defender will go under and around the screener. And this is good against people that aren't like really good outside shooters, but they can attack the basket. So LeBron James, Dwayne Wade, and all of them. Switch just means that on ball defender will always try to switch. So now he's going to the screener. So that means uh, the on ball defender picks up after the picks up the ball handler. Hedge means that this will control how the on ball defender is matched up to the screener. And how he will react to the screen. And this is a good way to slow down the dribbler during a screen. By stepping out to defend him briefly. And then getting back to the original matchup. So auto just means that the game will decide. And then no hedge means that the, -ball, def the off ball defender will stay close to the screener. And then soft hedge means that the off ball defender steps out to briefly impede. Or I mean disrupt the dribbler's path. And then hard drive means that the off ball defender steps further out to force the dribbler to take longer routes around the screen. So it just means that they'll have to take a longer route to uh, get to the basket. And that, that's really good against using LeBron James and Carmelo Anthony. It's good against using them. And the double means that the off ball defender will stay on the dribbler for the double team. So it pretty much is good for double teaming and all that. Now, I want to show you guys some quick tips. Now, if you really want to uh, play defense and you're playing a tight game, make sure that you take late game fouling the manual. So late game fouling just means if you press the back button, it will create a personal foul. And that's just pretty much it. So you can do that manually. Now, if you put on automatic, if you're playing a tight game, then... That means your team will automatically try and steal the ball and it'll just create personal fouls and the other team will just keep getting like just keep getting free throws and it's just annoying and it just it'll cost you some close games, trust me. It cost me a lot of close games. And then coach profiles. This is something you want to use if you want to keep up your defensive pressure. So say for a hundred, you're you're gonna be pressuring the crap out of them. And help defense is where other players on your defense will help you out, but it's just um, 
So if you keep it to 100, then they'll always help you out. But if you keep it to zero, they won't help you out. And then double team is just, you know, it just automatically, double, like, tells you when they want to double team. So if you point automatic, it will automatically double team whatever it wants to. So if you put it to 100, it'll, dump, it'll double team a lot. But if you put it to zero, it won't even double team. So that's all I have for you today, guys. Tune in for all their defensive settings and defense tutorials and offense tutorials. That's, that's what I want to do. So tune in, guys.